uh, you may count me on Norma. Yeah. Did you call me Norma? Uh, she doesn't really call you. What happens is she's, you know, almost kills her kids. Then she calls Clotilde to come in. She mm -hmm. said, no, she can't do it. She calls Clotilde in. Hi, I'm Anna Marie Kramer, Anne Marie Kramer, um, and I'm singing the role of Norma. I've, um, I've been singing in uh, all the other European countries and the uh, UK was the only place left I hadn't sung yet, so I'm really, really excited. And I love the country, I love the people, so happy to be here. It's, um, she has this sort of natural strength and natural leadership in her. It's because of the, the talent she has, the gifts that she has um, for um, seeing things that other people don't see, having these sort of magical, witchy kind of powers. And because of it, people just give her that power also. It's always a two-side, it's a two-way thing. Um, and she gets that from the people because she has these talents, yeah. And she grows stronger and stronger throughout her life, I think. Well, which is short, but. <laughs> People in power are often very alone, and Norma is a very lonely woman. Up until she meets uh, Polione, she is um, very separate fr from the rest. And um, he's the first person, I think, who really gets to her and uh, to whom she also really can show herself in a, a vulnerable, more vulnerable way. So, um, yeah, I think pe people look up to her. So that's difficult to have then sort of normal relationships. <laughs> Was, it's funny because I was the first uh, Dutch soprano to sing it after the, our uh, big star in, in, uh, in, in Holland, uh, Christina Deutekom. She sang it 35 years ago and I, was the sec I am the second Dutch soprano to sing the part uh, in Holland and anywhere really. And um, I worked also with her on the part, which was really nice. She's already 80 years old now and we're sitting side by side and I said, she really remembered all of it, not only her own part, my part, but also all the other roles and the words and everything. It was really exciting and she gave me some tips and it was really nice. Yeah. No, I definitely uh, think that it's, uh, being an opera singer is not just about having a nice voice, a beautiful voice, and, and being able to act it out, but also you have, there's so much going on around this, the, the actual singing on stage, and to, to be able to manage all that, you really have to have uh, an, an inner strength, an inner core, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I am that, I think, <laughs> yes, definitely. Oh, <laughs> my 